A viral TikTok video has now prompted Anderson Community Schools to review its use of a Native American as its mascot. Fox 59's Max Lewis explains how the school is responding and why activists say this issue goes way beyond Anderson. This video showing two students dressing as an Indian chief and maiden has been viewed nearly a million times. It was shot at an Anderson High School home basketball game. The students can be seen performing a ritual with a pipe before the game. It was disappointing but not surprising that it was happening. Sarah Holba shot the now viral video. And the Anderson student section got really into it. They had the pet band playing. And when Sarah shared the video, it received so much backlash that Anderson Community Schools put the pregame ritual on hold. We're taking this very seriously. You know, it's always our intent to honor our Native American tradition, and maybe that was ignorant. Maybe we don't know what we're honoring. Maybe we're not honoring at all. The district formed an internal committee to review the use of the Indian mascot on everything from buildings to letterhead. The mascot originated from Chief William Anderson, who the city of Anderson is named for. The superintendent said the district has always used the mascot with the blessing of the chief's ancestors. It really incites an environment that is hostile, that is dangerous, and um, damaging. Groups including the Delaware Tribe and the American Indian Movement have spoken out, saying it further exploits the culture of people who have been treated poorly since the arrival of the early settlers. They teach non-native children that it's acceptable to participate in culturally abusive behavior. The district says it will consult with Native American leaders before making its final decision. Max Lewis, Fox 59 News. Max, thank you. Some members of the Anderson community have spoken out against the mascot change, but the American Indian movement says just because it's tradition doesn't make it okay. You can read more about the history of the mascot on our website at fox59.com.